Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all keeping safe. In today's video we are going to be heading over to Poundland to go on a shopping spree because there's so much stuff we need and the girls want to look in the Pep & Co clothing section because Molly told me earlier she really wants a pair of ripped jeans, don't you? Mm -hmm. And Bella needs some new clothes for her gymnastics and just everyday wear because it's nice and sunny outside so we're going to head over there now. Now at Poundland and it looks like they have some really nice stuff in store so we have a trolley and we're ready to go inside. If you want to treat yourself to a foot mask they have so many in here to choose from. They have a charcoal one, coconut water, tea tree and peppermint. They have some new products from Jess Wright. They have these gold headbands which look absolutely stunning. They also have a selection of makeup brushes and eyelashes. Also by Jess Wright, they have instant and gradual tan and these are only 50p each. We're now in the Pep & Co section and they have lots of bikinis in here starting at £2.50. They also have these leopard print lip blocks for £1. Pajamas are so reasonable in here. This leopard print set is only £5 and they also have Disney ones for £8. They have lots of basic tank tops starting at only £1 and I absolutely love this design but I wish they had a t-shirt in this design with sleeves because I have bingo wings and this would just be too revealing for me. I found a range of t-shirts but I really don't like the detailing on the bottom but if you like them they have lots of different colours and they are £5 each. Have you found something you like? Bella likes orange. Eight to nine Bella. Whoa. Yeah, but this this is the imposter. The imposter? Yes. Oh, These because it's in the... with the others. Yes, it's the imposter. Bella, do you like it? Yes. Do you want this? Yeah. How much is it? Let's have a look. Four pounds. So that's the first thing in our trolley. I'm not sure how many young kids are watching Friends, but I've just found these t-shirts and I think they're absolutely stunning. They're only four pounds fifty each. Do you like this, Bella? Yeah. Okay, you can have that too. Molly's yet to pick something. She really wants some ripped jeans. They're not ripped, but I need some jeans. Well, you can make them ripped quite quickly. <laughs> yeah. Bella is currently doing gymnastics and she doesn't have a lot of sportswear. And I've just found this set. The top is £3 and the bottoms are only £3.50. So I'm going to be getting one of these sets because they are just perfect. Molly's just found a range of shorts and they're only £2 each. Oh my word, these are vibrant. You can get pink, blue and black. There's but only seven to eight in black. And they don't have Molly's size. How about the pink ones? Spot you a mile off in those. They have a range of 101 Dalmatian t-shirts. This one is only three pounds, but this one is one pound more expensive because it has a velvet detailing, but it's so cheap for Disney. Bella's just found a hat that she wants. It's very glittery and it's three pounds. Go and put it in the trolley then. We are struggling to find stuff for Molly because she hates pink and there's so much pink in here. Look how glittery these gold trainers are and they're only six pounds. I wish they had these in adult size. I absolutely love the baby section at Pep & Co. I'm going to see if they have these in Bonnie's size because I absolutely love the design. Only four pounds fifty for two. And I really like this design. This pack is three pounds fifty. Molly just found this for Cloud. She absolutely loves it and it's two pounds. It's a bit too small, Molly. Let's go and find the proper size. Yeah, this will fit him. Okay, let's do that. How adorable is this daddy's little princess dress and it's only £3.50. Bella's just found these baby trousers and they are so adorable. It's a crocodile and you zip it to open its mouth. Only £3. I don't know if they have the size. Yes, they do. 12 to 18 months. Oh, I have to get those. This top is adorable. I absolutely love it. It reminds me of Finding Nemo, the seagulls. And the top is only £2. I need the smaller size though. I managed to find a size I needed for this top. So we got this and these crocodile trousers. Also the digger top. I found these dinosaur sleep suits, which are absolutely adorable. And this design and everything else that I've already shown you. We're currently looking for a new t-shirt for Callum because his t-shirts are really old. This one is super tight, but they don't have any nice designs here. 
I mean, all they're all California or Hawaii or Cabo. I've just found a rack of plain t-shirts. These look a lot better. Oh, that's nice. Well, it's plain t-shirts. You'll be matching me. I'm wearing grey. <laughs> How much are these ones? £2.50. They look like the exact same grey. Yeah, we're going to match, aren't we, Cal? Matchy, matchy, all the way. Molly just found this t-shirt, which she absolutely loves for Dad, but he says, no way will I wear it, so I think we should buy it yeah. and put it at the bottom of the trolley, so go and hide it. A few moments later... Oh no, caught red-handed! No. I think that would look really nice, Cal. It's not me. But it's look beautiful. at that. Look at that. At least it will fit. Wear it, wear it, wear it, wear it! Yay! If you know a child who loves cars, I've just found this set. It's a fire engine, a police car, and an ambulance for only one pound. They also have giant Poundland trucks. These are three pounds. One thing I really hate at Poundland at the moment is the pricing. You'll find something for one pound, and then you'll move down, and something will be three pounds. Bella's just found the fidget toys, so they have quite a lot to choose from. They have a pop-it key ring. They also have this pop and spin in two different colours and fidget bracelets. Molly just found this bucket of chalk and she's going to buy it because she likes drawing. So she's going to attempt to draw on the path outside our house. I've done it before. Have you? very tiny chalk. Oh, okay, at least you've got a good set of chalk now. You get 15 pieces in those. When the schools were closed, these books were a godsend to me. They have so many to choose from and they go with the national curriculum. They have English, phonics, they even have Marvel and Disney themed ones with reward stickers. I found out today that Molly took my old iPhone 6 out of the drawer and has started using it and she's looking for a case. But I don't think you'll find a pretty case for the iPhone 6 because these are a lot of the new models. The only 6 case I can find. Well that's not too bad. I can put some stickers on it actually. Yeah, have a look for some stickers. Molly has also found the screen protectors. So if you do have an iPhone 6, they do have cases and screen protectors in here. Are you planning a party, Molly? She's picked up golden paper straws and these cocktail party umbrellas. I saw one of these before at like, a school disco thing. I always wondered where you got them. Pineland. I found them. <laughs> they have some really nice kitchenware in here. They have black bowls. They also have side plates and large plates. And also this, I thought it was plastic because it's only one pound, but it's actually glass. It's got really busy in here, so sorry about the background noise, but I'm picking up a measuring jug and a bowl because I want to do some baking. And I've just spotted these. I used to have these as a kid. Brings back memories, definitely getting some of those. If you want to organize your kitchen, they have lots of products in here, but make sure you check the price because not every item is a pound. These are really handy for bottles and jars. I'm not sure how much this one is. I think it's two pounds, but this one is one pound. It's so annoying. You never know the price in here anymore. I really like these stacking mugs and they are only one pound each. And there's lots of colors to choose from. They even have purple and pink. And I also like these soup mugs. You can get them in pink, gray or blue. We are now in the art section and Molly has definitely stocked up. Look how much stuff you have there. Do they have markers that are not double-ended, please? Do they have markers that are not double-ended? Put those in the trolley and we'll have a look. And I think Bella wants to show us that she's getting some notebooks. They are really pretty. Molly's just found these fine liners, which are not double-ended. But why don't you want double-ended? You lose the lids. Oh, There's okay. There's a pile of them. Oh, okay, so. Don't lose the lids for these ones. Molly, would you buy a box with four rocks in it for a fiver? Not for a fiver. Five pound and you buy a box of rocks. They've got better ones though. They've got reflexology. No, 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 no. They don't have rocks in. They've got a pair of socks. Oh, okay. Mum, I found Dad's worst nightmare to clean up. Oh, glitter. We hate glitter. And a lot of Callum's family members put glitter inside birthday cards. Deliberately. So when you open them up, it goes everywhere. Yeah, that can go back. Okay. But if you are looking for glitter, they have lots of colours to choose from. If you like planners, they have so many in here. They have to-do lists, shopping lists, weekly planners. They have lots of different colours of these. Meal planners in two different designs. And they also have these notebooks. These ones also have to-do lists inside. 
What are you after? Some rubbers and sharpeners because I'm going to need them. A rubber and sharpener. I need them. And yeah. didn't you want rulers as well, Molly? Yeah. So you get these ones. The last two items. Bella is getting this water bottle and Molly is getting this stainless steel one. So put them in the trolley. Yeah. And it's time to check out. So we're now at checkout. Leave a comment below with a guess of how much you think all this is going to cost. Last item. £89.40. You have spent so much of my money today. We're now back home and as you saw in the previous clip we managed to spend £89.40 pence in Poundland. I'm not sure if it's the most I've ever spent in Poundland but it's definitely towards the top of the list. The girls were so excited that they rushed inside with all their goodies and they're playing with them now. So I just wanted to end this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and until next time I'll see you soon. Goodbye.